Good morning. Sometimes things get wild and dad lets you play with all the kitchen toys on the couch. He's digging Aladdin. Happy Friday, James. Good afternoon. I'm out and about with James. I'm getting some supplies for a little art project we're gonna do. This'll, this'll do, I think. For so long, I have dreamed about hanging up our kids' artwork in our house. And even though James is just shy of one, we're gonna make some artwork and we're gonna hang it up and it's gonna be hopefully what I envision it to be. And then it'll hopefully inspire us to get the dining room together because that's where it'll be going. Um, I know Peter showed it in the vlog yesterday, but our family is having a small get together at our home for James's birthday. And that's like our goal to like have our apartment like feel like totally, you know, put together after all the chaos this year has had. So I think this will be the beginning of getting that all situated. So that is exciting. I don't think we're gonna do the art project today. It is nearing the end of the day and we wanna get out and about because it's Friday. So I'm gonna pick up some celebratory Friday drinks and head back home. All right, work is done. Um, tonight we kind of came together very last minute. We did. We were looking at all the different things going on and we were thinking about, we had like options. And then we got a message from one of you offering some Cubs tickets, so. We kind of combined plans. We're going to an Oktoberfest and then we're walking over to Wrigley. Yes, so it's by a nearby church. We've never been here before. But I'm excited, it like feels like a folly thing to do. You wanna hear a confusing thing. We're in Lakeview, but near the west side of Lakeview, but we're not in West Lakeview. Yeah. <laughs> and with that I say, pretzels. Und beer. Und beer. Also my iPhone did not arrive yet, so I'm no. a little nervous that they're not gonna get it in the building. Right. I think we're gonna bounce because it's beginning to rain. You wanna head towards the field? Right, 
we are walking to Wrigley now. We are walking in pace with a rainstorm. <laughs> and they are playing the Cardinals tonight, so that's exciting. That's a big game. It's probably, I mean, the regular <laughs> the regular season is coming to a close. So this will probably be, I mean, it is going to be our last game of the season. But it's so exciting because James is so much older now than he was when we went earlier and so much warmer today than it was when we went. So I'm excited to see how he likes it. And it will probably be our last game not being season ticket holders. Fun fact, underneath uh, the CTA right here, just on the east side of the field, you can do bike and stroller parking, like coat check for the game. Here we go. Is the view from our seats. Um, he's wearing a Cubs jersey, but he is clapping and cheering for the Cardinals. We're on the visiting team side, so like a lot of people around us are Cardinals fans. The James is making all the friends because we're right here on the aisle. <laughs> Everybody's loving him. He's just clapping. Any reason he gets to clap, you James, you cannot be a Cardinals fan. The Cardinals keep getting home runs. Look at that score. Stop laughing. Another one. It was a shorter game. Yeah. We're getting out of the head of the crowd and we're going to go stop by Jewel. I'm actually happy because I thought we were going to be leaving before the seventh inning stretch, but we got to see it. Yeah. Yes. And it's funny, like, I think that actors, and like many other things, I think one of his lesser known things <laughs> is his role in Little Women. Yeah. But we love him in Little We should watch Little Women tonight. Why not? I'm not crazy about him in Little Women, but I like I Little Women. Know, but we should watch that Little Women. <laughs> okay. The more superior. Did you show women. that we, like, checked our stroller? Yeah, I did. I did. So cool. strange, yes. right? Yeah. But cool. It's done by the Cubs organization, I hope. I think so. I think so. Looks legit. We pass it a bunch. We'll find out. It's on the other side of the red line, but we'll see. Hopefully our show is there. Sarah's having many aversions to food flavors and everything, so we realized we needed to think of almond milk when we got to the very front of the store. And she's, I was like, oh, it's back there. She's like, wait, it's back there past all the cheese and everything? It's like, yeah, just stay with James. I'll go in my back and grab it. She's so funny. Now we've got our pizza in, home run in. Got some jalapeno poppers. And now it's time for me to open up my new phone. Look at this sleek phone. So I got the iPhone 13 Pro in that blue. Whew. Also, all you need in life is a hairbrush and a piece of garbage. Sick, bro.
Look at that sleek phone. Okay, the lenses are kind of obnoxious. Really large. Oh, oh, this is a fancy cover. Oh, this feels nice. I got my grubby fingerprints on it already. <laughs> Check it out. Need a case. Mm, maybe. Yeah, go for it. I don't care. I'm more pumped for these uh, jalapeno peppers that are about to. I think if you do the top button. Oh, you did. <sighs> Guess who fell asleep on the couch? Sarah and I did. So I, I fell. Well, I was just watching Little Women while Sarah was putting James down. She came out and we fell asleep. So I just woke up. It's one in the morning. Just woke up, Sarah. We're going to go to bed. So. My phone is all set up. It took a while to download. I haven't set up a phone in like two and a half years, three years. And so to download everything and organize it all. So it's all good. So my new fancy phone is all set. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>